Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ebony and I make videos on fashion and styling. So if you are into that kind of thing, then you should definitely, definitely stick around. Now today's video is going to be a styling video and it's going to be a nine spring-ish outfits inspired by Under the Tuscan Sun, which is one of my favorite movies and it's one of my favorite kinds of videos to do where I just watch a movie that I love, take inspo from the outfits, and then go to my own closet and try to put together outfits based on the looks in the movie. Now these aren't going to be exact copies because you guys know that's not what I do even though I may have things that really go along with it. But my goal isn't to um, exactly recreate but it's just to pull inspiration and use the clothes that I have to put together new outfits. So I'm really excited for this video and let's get right into it. So for this first look, I didn't have any linen pants, but I have these uh, silk ones. Everything in this outfit is thrifted. I paired it with a white t-shirt and a linen shirt, wicker bag, and pink loafers. I know she has a pink scarf, so I figured I don't have a pink scarf, but I have pink loafers so I can add some color to the look. I love the texture that the bag adds. I think it's very easy and simple and super fun. Um, like I said, it also helps that the bag is like a tannish color when the pants aren't completely white so it brings in all the colors together for this one i have again everything thrifted the coat is gap and i'm wearing vintage gucci loafers and this bag that i also thrifted that's liz claiborne but then i think this is how francis would wear it but i did go ahead and switch out the bag and the shoes for something that more similar to what I would wear because I'd want it to be a little fun. So I added my sparkly sequin bag and then a pair of patent flats just to add a little bit more texture and shine to the look. So I think that's a good way to um, adapt these things to your styles. Just switch out some of the accessories for things that you feel are more you. Um, and then for this next one, it's a little different for me. These are my Everlane jeans that I always wear. They're cuffed, but I can wear them straight like this, which I think would definitely be more of a Francis thing. I have a thrifted oversized gray cardigan and a pair of black cowboy boots under the jeans. And I think this is very much her and her like divorce apartment era, but a little more, a little more stylish. This is my take on the white dress. I tried it with a black belt, but I felt like it was like too spot on and I don't think I would actually wear this outfit with a belt like that. So I have this completely thrifted look with a linen skirt from uh, Banana Republic, a white t-shirt, and a pair of little black patent black uh, block heels and a black clutch. My favorite part about this look is just how it moves. I can't wait to wear it myself soon. This is kind of an ode to her friend. I think her name's Catherine, the one that has the ice cream because she's very bold and she wears red. So I just wanted to throw that in there. And this video was also feeling a bit too neutral, so I wanted to add some color. But this one is another one of my favorites. This has no, I guess, direct inspiration from the movie, but I feel like it's definitely something that she would wear. It's kind of another version of that white dress that she wore, but this one is black and gingham. And again, everything is thrifted. Now, this one is an example or like my take on the outfit that she wore when she first got to Tuscany and she's wandering around and she says, you know, the grapes even, what did she say? They smell purple or they taste purple. <laughs> so I love this one. I tried it untucked and tucked. Again, everything is thrifted except the blazer, which is from Blank NYC. And I really love how this look turned out. I think this is another one that I'm going to bookmark for myself to wear later. This is one of my favorite vintage dresses. I <laughs> dresses. I found it in a rummage sale and I love it. It's perfect for that orange dress that we all know is such a wow in the movie. Again, this is vintage. My shoes are thrifted sacks and I have a raffia clutch. Alrighty guys, thank you so, so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. I um, had so much fun filming this. And yeah, again, let me know which other movies you'd like me to see. I know I've had requests for a Double Wears Prada, but like a second part, because I've already done that. I've had requests for um, Marvelous Mrs. Maisel, which I've done before, but I'm sure I could probably do it a little better. I think it'd be fun for the summer because that's a lot of bright colors. But if you guys have any other movie re oh and i've had a wreck for clueless but anyway if you have any other ones please let me know um just so i can have those ideas from you guys and don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you liked what you saw have something to say or just like to keep up with the rest of the videos i'll be posting here and until next time i'll see y'all later bye